Republic of Sailing Armed Forces has showcased its naval and his capabilities following a four-day border security exercise conducted in conjunction with the United Kingdom Royal Marine short-term training team. The Republic of Sailing Armed Forces, namely the Maritime Wing MW and the Forces Reconnaissance Unit FRU, on Friday 20th April 2018, took part in the show demonstrating RSLAF capabilities. The demonstration of force, according to Lieutenant Thomas Brunt of the United Kingdom Royal Marine, the exercise was intended to showcase the naval and air capabilities in confirmation of maritime wing boat handling and maintenance skills and the force reconnaissance unit in Riverine deployment and recovery exercise. So we've been out here for five weeks now. We've conducted a four-week training package. That's been split in two. We've got the force reconnaissance unit training with my team from 4-2 Commando Royal Marines. And we also have the maritime wing training with uh, ranks from 539 Assault Squadron Royal Marines. We did two weeks individual unit training. So we trained uh, boat handlers in the maritime wing and engineers in the maritime wing. We then trained the FIU uh, alongside that in uh, reconnaissance skills, so close target reconnaissance, observation posts, reporting, uh, and some break contact drills as well, uh, as well as navigation and first aid. After those two weeks, we then brought the two teams together. We conducted integration training to allow them to work together. Uh, and that involved practicing our beach landings and beach assaults and also withdrawing from that and patrolling in a, a riverine environment. After that there was a four day confirmatory exercise where we deployed for four days uh, down the Bunce River conducting all the skills that had been taught previously and it has culminated today in a demonstration on Lumley Beach in which you saw a, a dolphin vehicle checkpoint um, being launched and arresting some smugglers on, a, on the road here. Very enthusiastic uh, bunch, they're, they're very eager to learn, very willing to learn, which makes teaching very, very easy. Uh, everything we give them, they just want to soak it all up and then put it into practice, so it's, it's, been, it's been a great pleasure. What's been identified is that Sierra Leone has a very large land border and um, maritime border into the ocean, into the sea. Part of the land border there are a lot of rivers and so by training the maritime wing in the use of small boats and riverine operations we enable a, a lot of mobility, to, the, the ability to move in that environment. Then training the FIU in reconnaissance skills then gives them the ability to gather as much information as possible give that to the police who can then conduct targeted arrest operations on the criminals that are, that are crossing the border. The four day border security exercise was conducted in conjunction with the United Kingdom Royal Marine short term training team aimed at building the capacity of the military. The exercise was done in full view of the public at Lumley Beach in Freetown in the waters around Freetown and a field areas at Hastings. For Star News, Creighton Thomas reporting compiled by Abdulrahman Kamar.